I have never wanted to become an entrepreneur. When I was young, I watched my brothers start their businesses and run them successfully. I had always been a bookworm and I felt life should be taken slowly. Fast forward several years later, I became content with the fact that I was an entrepreneur. Not only had I started businesses that failed and learned from, I had also begun businesses that succeeded. This may have come from paying my dues and learning in the trenches. I have seen young people who think they're too young to start a business. I laugh at this idea because if you just take a look around, you'll notice that most successful businesses today were started by young people. Also, technologies have made opportunities to abound that young people can take advantage of. So, if you're a young person who thinks you can't start a business, throw that idea away. You really can start any business and succeed in it tremendously. This is why in this video, I want to share with you 5 ways you can start to make money fast as a young entrepreneur. 1. Start writing books, articles, etc. My first business in copywriting and email copywriting especially earned me 6 figures for several months in its inception. When I started to take ghost writing projects, I earned even far more than a few writers make writing countless articles every week. Apart from making so much money as a book author, contrary to most belief, you can also make so much just writing articles, newsletters, etc. I know a friend who more than 6 years ago, even as a young person, was earning a minimum of $100 per article. That was a lot of money back then. If you're a writer like me, you can start to write books, articles, newsletters and other types of written materials or content for people. As a writer over 10 years, I have written books, poems, stories, newsletters, etc. and have gotten paid paltry sum and also hugely in almost all of these areas. I have written books for people under a month that earned me enough to pay my rent. You may want to start your own blog to be publishing your write-ups. But if you want to dig in real fast to make money, then get to profiting from your writings ASAP by selling your work. If you're a writer or a writer wannabe, know that there are opportunities for you out there. There are businesses, websites, individuals and organizations looking to have writers who submit their work to them. Some pay a paltry, some pay hugely. Check out Fiverr, Upwork, Freelancer, etc to see how to sell your writing services. Yet, my best advice for selling your writing is to write and publish your books. This way, you can measure your success yourself and even find other creative ways to make money off of your writing. 2. Take clean photos and sell them I love good photos and I know there are tons of young people who do too. There are a few photo sites that accept photos of various kinds. Some of these sites also pay you for submitting your photos. A website like Shutterstock helps you earn up to $120 for each of your images people download. iStock Photo pays you a minimum of 15% of any sales of your photo. You can make anywhere from 20% to 60% with Adobe Stock. To start selling your photos, you don't have to be a professional photographer. Neither do you need expensive equipment to take great pictures. I am aware most young people use far much more expensive phones than their parents. Well, it's time to put that waste into use. With your iPhone or a good smartphone with a solid camera, you can start to take photos and sell them online. It's a matter of shooting what matters, shooting what's fun, entertaining and selling it. If you're willing to take the business very seriously, you can get some good photo gadgets that will increase your buck earning ability in photo selling. Also, nothing stops you from being the go-to photographer in your neighborhood. This way you can make money selling photos online and shooting folks in your area. In this photography world, how creative you are will determine how quickly and hugely you'll succeed. 3. Start a small business in your neighborhood when we were little, my older brother started a shoemaking business. He would go around houses to ask who needed to mend or polish their shoes. Then he started a cleaning business. He would go to people's homes to ask who needed to clean their apartment and environment. 
he thrived in these businesses. Look around your neighborhood and start a business. The good thing is that since you're young, you have an advantage most adults don't have. Most neighbors will encourage you because they feel you're taking the initiative as a young person to start. I once read in Mark Victor Hansen and Jack Kingfield's Chicken Soup for the Soul about a little child who vowed to his parents that he would sell some neat stones he found to his neighbors. He set up his shop out on the street in front of their house and sold the stones. Identify a need you can meet in your neighborhood and start to meet it. What is funny? There will always be a need around you. What matters is being able to find it. When you do so, you aren't just making money in the process, you're learning to become an entrepreneur. 4. Start a local magazine or newsletter Most people are ashamed to start small because small seems ridiculous. But when Sir Richard Branson was 16, he started a magazine titled Student for students in his school. As he grew older, he started other businesses until using his inclination towards identifying opportunities he discovered the concept to launch the Virgin Airlines when he simply chartered a plane and paid for it with passengers' money. You too can start small like this and grow. Imagine a local magazine or newsletter for teens in your neighborhood, printed and delivered each week for a certain amount. You may never have to spend so much to start your magazine or newsletter business. You may even sell on a pre-order basis, then use the money to print the first batch of magazines or newsletter copies. With the advent of technology and the internet, you can even sell your magazine or newsletter via the internet. Most big digital businesses started stupidly. Some started even as a joke. What current information do people always look for in your neighborhood or school? What information don't they look for, but they need regardless? Choose a theme you love reading about, text stories, scientific information, etc and start to publish 5 to 10 pages of newsletter or magazines on it. You may not make so much money now, but imagine growing that your business into a successful media empire some day to come. That's how most successful media empires started. 5. Read books on making money Hey, it's not for want of ideas that I make this tip last. I know this tip does not make you money directly. but. Imagine when your mates are busy spending their time on games and fun, you spend yours reading books on business and personal finances. Imagine when they are spending more than they earn, while you are busy putting into practice the money management lessons you've learned from these books. You will not only be saving your money, but you will also be building the repertoire of knowledge you need to make so much more money. Two men were told to cut down a tree. One took his blunt cutlass immediately and started to cut. The other one took some time to sharpen his cutlass before he started cutting. Who do you think cut down the tree seamlessly and fast? This is how reading books on money is profitable to you. You may not see the benefit now, but you will see the benefit later. One solid idea from a book can make you the richest man in your neighborhood or country in no time. If you're a young person, you're not too young to start a business. You can pick from any of the ideas above to start a business today. Write books or articles for sale. If that's too simple, shoot clean photos with your smartphone and sell them on some photo websites. Additionally, you can start a business in your neighborhood and grow your business knowledge by reading books on money and business. When you pay the price to make money, the money will certainly come to you. If this video inspired you, like the video and share it with your friends. We love you.